What's up everyone? Train Freak here. And today we got another operations. We've got the Rock Island local making its way. And it's going to drop off some cars and pick some cars up out of the yard, which we'll see in a minute. And yeah. All right, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and stop our train right here. And let's see here. So this is our list to do. We've already done the green stuff, so we're going to do the reds here. So we're going to set out the two Wilson cars or WCLX over at the ice dock. And let's see what else we're going to do. We got three cars, a Rock Island car and two Budweiser cars going to track three and a cotton belt going to track two and then we'll put the caboose on track four and then we'll start building the outbound train. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. These are the two Wilson cars here, so we're going to put them over at the ice dock. You can see the yard right there. I'm gonna go ahead and throw our switch. Let's go ahead and back this bad boy in. And throw our switch. Alright, so we're going to have to back up so we can throw this switch here. switches are thrown. But we're going to drop that caboose off right there in front of the ice dock. I should be able to clear that. All right, gonna go ahead and unhook here. There we go. And we gotta do a run around. And we'll go ahead and throw this switch. We'll go ahead and connect to our caboose. Alright, line our switch up and we're going to connect to our cotton belt car here. Now 
now we got to pull these cars back because they need to go into track two. Should be good, so let's see if we can get her unhooked. Alright, and then we gotta move this box car into track three. put our caboose on the yard ladder so we can run around it that's a good spot right there in the middle oh wow I wanted to roll on me Take that switch. I'm gonna throw it back. I'll give you a different view. And while he's going to come in and connect, we're going to kind of go ahead and look here. Looks like we got a lot of pickups from track one and two pickups from track two and then our caboose on track four. So we'll have to make sure we get all the right cars because we got quite a few. get this dude unhooked. It's kind of hard to see. There we go. Alright, so Alright, so I said we had a couple of cars on track too, so we'll need to look and see uh, which cars we meet off a of track two. And it shows to be a WCLX and a SLRX. So WCLX 2467, SLRX 3374. So we're gonna go ahead and connect and I bet you it's gonna be those two cars on the far end. All right.
All right, there's our SLRX St. Louis Railroad Company and the Wilson car lines. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and connect these to our caboose. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop the cars right here. And we're gonna disconnect our last two cars right there. And then we're gonna shove the rest of this back into track two. Once it clears the switch here. All right, so I just counted. We've got nine cars sitting on track one. So we got four Rock Islands. And Ashley drew a northern Rock Island gondola. We got a seaboard airline, a cotton belt, and another Rock Island. So we'll have to see exactly which cars it wants us to pick up. We're gonna pick up eight cars out of this one. So before we look, let's see, it wants a Rock Island gondola, so that's pretty simple. Let's see, we got one, two, well, actually the only car that I'm seeing that it still wants to keep here is that Seaboard Airline. So, because I'm seeing one, two, three, four, five Rock Island box cars. So we got one, two, three, four, and that one on the far end. It's wanting a um, an Ashley Jura Northern, which is right there, and then it wants the Cotton Belt, which is way down there. So what we're going to have to do is pick up this whole cut, we'll take the cotton belt and the far Rock Island car and we'll connect it to this Budweiser car over here, we'll drop the Seaboard Airline car back on track one, then take the rest of the cut, couple it back to the cotton belt, and then our train will be built and we'll be able to pull on out.
So there's our car that we'll have to put back on track one. That box car there, I weathered in a video. I'll put a card in the upper right corner if you're interested. All right, now we just need to throw the switch. There we go. All right, we'll uncouple here. All right, so we're not going to send this car all the way down to the end. There's no point in that. We just need it to be far enough that we don't clip it when we try to do something in track two at another time. So that will work. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and connect the Rock Island gondola back to my weathered cotton belt boxcar. And then our train will be built and it can go back to Little Rock, which is the staging for the Rock Island on the Delta Pines subdivision. All right, so we're done. We're gonna go ahead and pull out. With that being said, thank you for watching. If this is content that you like, make sure you hit that subscribe button, fill in the bell so you'll be notified on all future videos. And make sure you hit that thumbs up. That really helps get my videos out there to other people in YouTube land with the algorithm. So as the train goes away, we're gonna say y'all be safe out there and happy railroading. <laughs>